let me just say how great it is to be here after today's uh, flight readiness review. Uh, Jim did a great job leading the team through uh, a lot of complex topics, and uh, we are go for launch, which is absolutely outstanding. This day has been a long time coming. Uh, the review, as thorough as it was, in no way encompasses the amount of work that the team did to get us here, and I could not be more proud of our amazing NASA civil service contractor team that uh, put that rocket out on the pad and is getting ready to launch it, uh, hopefully, in, uh, in a week. Uh, you know, I do want to say uh, that I want to put this in perspective. Uh, this is a test flight, all right? And uh, it's uh, not without risk. We have uh, analyzed the risk as best we can, and we've mitigated it also as best we can. But we are stressing Orion uh, beyond it, what it was actually designed for in preparation for sending it to the moon with a crew. And we want to make sure that it works absolutely perfectly when we do that and that we understand all the risks. We're going to learn a lot from this test flight. There are certain cases that could come up that could cause us to come home early, and that's okay. We uh, have contingencies in place, and the main objective that we really want to get out of this test flight, of course, is that stressing that heat shield, getting a test of that new Orion heat shield at lunar reentry velocities. So I just want to say I'm really looking forward to this. We have worked really hard to get here. Uh, the team has done an absolutely outstanding job, and uh, as difficult as it is, we're up to the challenge, and I'm really looking forward to a successful test flight.